Jinbin and Son Ye Jin love a story how Romans blossom on the set of Crash Landing on You in 8 months. Love is in the air. 2021 just kick-started with some splendid news on our feet. According to dispatch, Jinbin and Son Ye Jin are in a relationship on January 1. Dispatch reported that the two star fell in love during the shooting of the hit drama Crash Landing on You and have been dating for the past 8 months. The co-star were rumored to be dating in the past but the agency squashed those reports multiple times. If the latest reports are to be believed, the two stars were not dating at the time and were telling the truth indeed. A source close to Yinbin and reportedly spilled the beans, saying love first bloomed for the two around March 2020. The insider added, I think that the after the drama ended and they spent time apart, they began to miss each other. Are Yinbin and Son Ye Jin in love? Dispatch claimed their mutual love for gold. Get Yunbin and Son Ye Jin closer and they met many times during crash landing on new filming. Along with its report, Dispatch published photos of Son Ye Jin getting into Yunbin's car. Son Ye Jin's agency responded to the report by stating, We are currently in the process of checking the actress after seeing the article. Long back, Jin Bin had said in an interview, There are times when I feel great charm and thrill from seeing the actor opposite me show unexpected acting. There also a thrill to my own reaction to that acting while filming the negotiation. I saw that in Sun Ye Jin, so I thought I want to try working with her again. At the time, we had filmed separately. So I wanted to try acting with her in the same space, making eye contact and breathing the same air. And that opportunity came quickly. What did the agency say? The news sent shockwaves in no time. Sun Yunbin Agency Bus Entertainment confirmed it, saying after Yunbin and Sun Ye Jin met through their projects and after the end of their drama, their positive feelings towards one another developed into a romantic relationship. We ask that you look warmly upon the relationship and cheer them on in the future. If that was not all, Son Ye Jin Agency Miss Team Entertainment 2 gave a green light and added, the two of them got to know each other through their acting projects, and after the end of their drama, they developed an interest in each other and ended up dating. Who is Yun Bin? Best known for his root in the 2005 romantic comedy My Name is Kim Sam Soon, Yun Bin has won many hearts with his root in Secret Garden, Memories of the Alhambra, Confidential Assignment, The Swindlers, and The Negotiation and Rampant. His performance in late autumn was lauded by many and the movie was screened at the 61st Berlin International Film Festival. He has received umpteenth nomination, including five of the Bexton Arts Award, and won the Grand Prize Destin for TV at the 47 Bexton Arts Award. In an interview from 2009, Yun Bin had predicted, I think my 30s will be my prime and I think I'll have my own family and settle down as if he thought his prediction has been accurate. The actor shared while laughing, I don't have my own family, so half of it was wrong. I wouldn't say I've settled down, but I do think i found stability. I think i become stronger and more relaxed. I'm more curious and interested in work, and there are more things I want to express. I'm also working on more projects than I did back then. Who is Son Ye Jin? Adored for her beauty, talent, and grace, Sun Ye Jin rose to fame in romance themed films and TV shows like the classic Summer Sun, A Moment to Remember, and April Snow. Did you know she also won many awards and gained recognition with movies like My Wife Got Married, The Pirates, The Truth Beneath, and The Last Princess? Born Sun Ye Jin on January 11, 1982, she first stepped into the world of glitz and glam after being the voice of Jung Mi Joo in Park Ki Kyung's film Secret Tears. Did you know she was the highest paid Korean actress in Korean television series in 2006? Reports say that she got a fee 50 million Korean won, 46,054 US dollar per episode for her lead role in SBS drama Alone in Love. How romance blossomed on the set. In an old interview for the negotiation promotion, Sun Yajin shed light on her band with Jin Bin. Talking about the dual filming process, she revealed how they saw each other during the shooting instead of the normal way. Not just that, she also said even though filming wasn't easy, 
Jinbin and she click really well because of their camaraderie on set. In the video interview, she also teased him, asking if she was the only one who felt that way. In an interview with Naver TV via Zumpi, they spilled the Bin's favorite scene from the show. Bin said, he loves the episode 9 ending sequence when Junyuk and Seri part ways so the latter escape back to South Korea. The scene show the feelings of Ri Junyuk who courageously crossed the military demarcation line to follow Yun Seri and it was a moment in which the two people overcame the reality the actor said in the interview. For more updates, subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell.